I was reading on the internet a, a while back here. It said, how to know when your job is in jeopardy. And one of the one of the things they listed was, your supervisor tells you to train other people to do your job. So I don't know if I want to teach y'all how to do this thing or not. I'm just joking there, I think. Okay, why do you ban? Well, I think Scott covered that. Uh, two, uh, two reasons. Number one, for a, a monitoring tool. I mean, we used to monitor to determine what areas actually need treated for gypsum moth. Another one is to minimize the number of females or the number of uh, cake worms you're going to have that particular year. So there's a couple reasons you ban. Um, so, materials. There, there's a document. Scott, did we give those out? Yeah. The banding. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you can look down on that document yeah. there if y'all brought it. Um, I'll, I'll just go through this box here. Plastic stretch wrap is this stuff here, and it's it's readily available here in town, but it's, it's very pliable. Um, there's a lot of other things you could use. Um, uh, duct tape. I've heard people say use duct tape. Um, Train wrap. Yeah. Roof felting is this stuff here. Roofers use. You could use it as well. It's, pre it's pretty durable stuff. The, the problem with it is it's it's almost it has to be stapled to trees. Most people don't like to put staples in trees, especially on the maple, because they will bleed pretty heavily in the spring. So we we would we would recommend. The ceramic wrap down, or the stretch wrap. You can buy it at um, Home Depot, and I think it's like eight dollars, eight no, no, excuse me, nine dollars a roll, thousand feet on the roll, which would ban quite a few trees. <laughs> Probably more than you want to do. The stuff they got there at Home Depot is is, is a blue tinge, almost like a blue smoke and collar. I don't think kind of, the kangaroos would know the difference, <laughs> but you, you can buy the stuff there. Um, and then the fiberglass. Pipe tape is this stuff here now. This stuff is needed for some of the trees and some not. We'll go over that here in a minute. As you can see, we wrote down an inch stuff and we end up with half inch stuff. We don't violate the law. They're not that particular. It'll work. Um, Tanglefoot insect barrier. Is this stuff here. Uh, it comes in three different forms. This is a regular caulking tube. Most people probably caulk your windows, whatnot. They have those in the southern states. They have the southern states, yeah, it's eight dollars, seven ninety nine too. Yeah. Um we'll say about it. As I said, it comes in a tub. A tub, I think it's like several pound tub. And it comes in a little squeeze tube, about like a toothpaste tube. This this you find locally, I don't know the other sources nearby that you can get it. Um, all this stuff. Bird on it? It's bird repellent. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's don't the name we want of it. the birds? <laughs> No, to keep them off of your, your ledges. Yeah, 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 they don't like the sticky yeah. landing. But like I said, all this stuff you can get locally if you choose to. Um, and you, you may want to consider, it, it, I'll leave it up to you all, but I mean, you, you go on Amazon, you can find stuff that might get a better price. The state bought a bunch of this from Amazon. It's like six fifty a two. Uh, a little bit of savings. Um, pull, pull together with your neighbors. I mean, it's going to help you out. But you, like I said, you can get that stuff locally as well if you choose. Um, of course, duct tape. I think most people got that. Red green, highly recommended. Uh, caulking gun. I'll pull everything out here. I'm sure y'all seen it before. Caulking gun, utility knife. Not necessary, really. I mean, you can use a parry knife for that matter. Uh, staple gun. That's not a staple gun. But staple like staple of batting, things of that nature. Um, gloves, you can choose, you don't have to. Uh, and then Gojo hand wipes for uh, for table clear. And I'll show you one of those. This is mainly for industrial use. They use it to clean uh, fiber optic cables. And I think you can buy this stuff on Amazon, but I, I doubt you can find it low place. Let's you know wipe something. that on the tree? No, no, clean up your tools. Oh, yeah. Okay. Tools yeah. And, yeah. 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 If nobody looks at, works for a telephone company, you might ask them, you might go to get the time. But anyway, but there, there's all the tools you need. <clears throat> um, okay, the the biggest thing here is timing. Um, we talk about putting the stuff up. The fall cake worms, it needs to be up late, probably late October. And if y'all's unsure, check with Miss Camille and we'll try to advise you when things look like they're going to happen. Um, it's best if you wait till leaves are down. 
but sometimes you don't have that option because you wait too late, you missed everything. That's what we dropped the ball this past year and got stuff up too late. So you're better off to get up a little early and get down with a few leaves and get up a little bit too late, I think. But uh, again, she'll be up uh, late October. Miss anything, Scott? You're doing good. All right. Uh, okay, species, tree species. Uh, we mentioned this before. If you got the option, pick an oak, not a maple. Uh, it's more preferred. We, we've, we've banned the trees for years. We've tried the um, oak, maple, and cherry. They both work, but we seem like we, we caught, captured more females with the oak than others. Trees, um, I should point out a couple of trees. Oak's eaten much more than maple, too. It seems like right. Maples didn't get that's, totally gone. That's they hit specific trees too. first. Yeah. Listen, how does the adult female know oak versus maple? Scent. That's a good question. Well educated. <laughs> they did research. Yeah. But I tell you, Shannon Dale, what I, I saw the caterpillars on first was hickory, and the reason being, they're one of the first things to pop out. Caterpillars, their emergence is based upon when the trees come out, and they're one of the first things out in the woods. And then, like I said, the maples, they, they seem like to shoot the maple early on, but once the oaks started coming out, then they switched over. But to but, answer your question, though, if you do much reading on it, a lot of times they'll say that that the larva will come down the tree that it was actually in, mm. go in the ground, pupate. The females or the moth, when it comes out, it's going to the. It can't see very good. It's going to the first big closest glob that it sees to go up and lay the eggs again. So wherever it was before, it's there again. Mm -hmm.